This is the energy vibration reading for the last week of May 2018. I want to say thank you. This is the energy vibration reading for the Capricorn Sun, Moon, and Rising, and welcome. The week is a duality week, so you Capricorns hold on because this week is a duality week. The week begins from the 28th until the 3rd of June. Please remember to go and listen to your monthly readings because there are information that is in the monthly readings for you guys. Um, don't forget to listen to the Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. I want to say to each and every one, it is a week of love, and the zodiac energy is the hair. Let's look for the Capricorn and see what is going to be coming up. On Monday you have a new start a positive new start so for you Capricorns there is a new start that is coming up on Monday on Tuesday you have the energy of um, the eight of ones information coming at you a lot of information so with the new start on Monday you could be receiving a lot of information on Tuesday that is coming at you on Wednesday you're seeing a situation for what it is which can be good and we are going to see ace of Pentacles comes up the crowning for the week so this is wonderful for you Capricorns congratulations Ace of Cups is coming up, so new love is coming in on Friday. And then we have the energy of the Queen of Pentacles. So you women are centered in the middle of the week. So it's going to be a wonderful week for you women. And it's going to be a week of um, the energy of the lovers. I'm loving your week. I'm so loving your week. Okay. I'm so loving your week, you Capricorns. You go. So, ladies, you Capricorn ladies out there, this is going to be the weekend. New love in the weekend. Okay. <laughs> and joy. Oh my God. You Capricorns, new love is coming in in the weekend. Okay, whatever art breaks that you have with a Pisces, a Cancer, or a Scorpion, do do. <laughs> whatever it is, ladies and gentlemen, I'm telling you, it doesn't worth it. So just let it go. Okay, let it go. If it was meant to be it was meant to be if it was meant to be it was meant to be you know um, the you know you are a cardinal sign and a balance sign okay and whenever something doesn't work out it's just you know it was not meant to be so you move on sometimes people come in your life to stay for a while and sometimes people come in your life to stay for a short time so god i love your week beginning of the week there's a new start and there's new love that is coming in there is information that is going to be coming at you swift information this could be text messages this could be email this could be information you could be in meetings and that sort of a thing you could be connecting with other people you know there could be communication you could be given a, a reading or whatever the situation but a lot of information is coming at you some of you are seeing a situation very very clearly you know some of you were being blindfolded and now you're seeing the truth of the situation money is going to be coming to you it's not a question it's not a thing there money is going to be coming into you then we have in the weekend a very positive weekend especially for the ladies you are going to meet someone um, very significant and you are going to be connecting with someone in love in this weekend so this is a positive week for you guys major arcana the a new start you're going on a new journey this is going to be good because you're you are you know you you are seeing where you're going you see this new part this new thing open up for you and this is good love is going to be happening for you guys new love um, someone new you um, single people are going to be meeting someone new okay 
uh, information is going to be coming to you okay so it could be that some of you are starting a new job and that sort of a thing and you're getting a lot of information especially on Tuesday or Wednesday coming in and it's going to be um, a good and um, positive um, you know you're going to have a good connection with whoever you're connecting with in the beginning of a week or in this week if you're starting a new job if you're starting to connect with other people there is going to be a new situations coming in we have the energy of the king of wands here and it's as if information is coming from this person it's as if this person is just won't stop um, this could mean that some of you are being stalked by someone who is and uh, uh, and uh, um, Aries Leo or Sagittarius you could be stalked by this person because whenever information is coming so at you is someone who is stalking you so uh, this person could be placing a lot of rings telephone rings to your telephone and that sort of a thing or um, with email or with words or that sort of a thing and you're now you're understanding who has been stalking you who has been um, doing these things okay so be aware of that wheel of fortune is going to bring a lot of you money in your life the ace of Pentacles is under the wheel of fortune so the wheel of fortune is bringing you money in your life whatever the situation is the wheel of fortune is bringing you a lot of money in your life then we have the energy of the ace of cups and the queen of pentacles a lot of you are going to be um, meeting and there is going to be the opportunity of new love coming in your life so um, the energy was that there was a heartbreak some of you have felt a loss in the weeks therefore and this loss have to do with someone who is a Pisces cancer or scorpion and now new love is going to be coming in and they're saying that there is a lot of people out there that wants to connect with you you're not just not opening up yourself Prince of Pentacles comes in so this could be um, for you guys the Prince of Pentacles there's new love coming in some of you could be connecting with um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person so you could be connected as good friends or um, as co um, um, colleague on the floor whoever this person is they're going to make you um, uh, rich okay whoever this person is because um, this could be for you ladies out there that you have met someone who has become a friend or someone who um, is going to be helping you to manifest um, money in your life because the wheel of fortune is of Pentacles and the energy of uh, it could be that some of you are meeting someone who is rich whatever it is um, they are saying to you that there is a lot of people out there that would like to connect with you so if you're a single um, person be open um, to whatever is coming up be open um, to whatever is coming up because um, positive energies is going to be coming in um, for you guys okay um, if you guys had a situation um, you know whatever the situation is in this week whatever the situation is in this week there is a new start for you Capricorns okay so the people who have suffered a loss this loss could be a loss of a job the loss of a position the loss of um, a situation okay it's not a person it's a loss of a situation of the loss of something in your life there is going to be a brand new start for you guys so um, you people out there who are going to start a new job this is going to be something that the universe have um, orchestrate for you so um, make sure that you do your best on this because this is something um, that the universe have orchestrate for you and this is going to be coming in in a positive way I'm seeing um, 
the um, people between the ages of 25 and 45 whether you're in a relationship or not in a relationship you are going to be connecting with a new love partner and this person is going to be helping you to open up um, the um, gate of abundance because the wheel of fortune is here above you so it's as if you're going to be connecting with someone and that person brings luck in your life um, this could be a mother and a son that is going to um, decide um, to go together and start a business and this business is going to be new I'm seeing um, whatever is happening um, with you um, whatever is happening with you guys and it has to do with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, this person is um, above the age of 40 so some of you ladies um, could be connecting with this man this could be a new love that is coming in because I'm seeing the energy of new love for you Capricorn ladies and this is a soulmate relationship so whoever you are out there congratulations um, sometimes you're in a relationship and you meet this person and you realize this is my soulmate and you know this person could be married or you are in a relationship or whatever but obviously it's a karmatic situation that has come around for some of you if you go in business with this person it's going to be positive I am seeing a positive outcome of this if you go in business with this person so let's say that someone who is a Pisces or a cancer says you know let's go in business I can honestly say going in business with a cancer or a Pisces it is a good move because these people are the Pisces are one of the richest people on this planet believe it or not because they're very hard-working and they always have good ideas coming up and um, some of you are going to be I don't know um, surprising news good news is going to be coming in um, um, the Virgos got this also and I've shuffled you just saw me shuffle the cards so um, you 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 Capricorns are going to be receiving some real positive news okay um it's going to be surprising news but it's going to be happy news this could be news over new contract or if you were waiting on um papers or you were waiting on um if you were looking for a mortgage or you wanted to buy a house or you needed money to pay off your truck or whatever it is it is as if the universe is going to be making this happen in this week and it's going to be positive so a positive week new start new start in work in new relationship new start in money um, the wheel of fortune is bringing you money um, new start um, with a new love a soulmate relationship especially you women um, it's the women that it's going to affect especially in the weekend you are going to be meeting someone and this person I let me see if this person some of you could know this person but then in the weekend you're going to realize that they're really your soulmate okay um, be aware um, for the people who are in relationship or um, you're having long distance relationship and you have met someone let's say you know you're in a long distance relationship but you have met someone where you are um, I think this person knows deep within their heart that they are connected with you and it's as if because um, you had the art break is as if um, there was a situation that happened and you decided to move away from this person because it's as if um, you saw something that you think um, okay there's sometimes because I know Capricorn people will do this Capricorn people will meet people and expect that they just come up front remove the mask let them show themselves and then 
this part you saw something and then you think now um, let me leave this is behind but this person is going to come back in the weekend this person is going to come back in the weekend and I, I I really I'm not going to say what you should do your heart will basically tells you what to do whoever this is this person um, I think they have um, this is someone who is um, you know between the ages of 25 and 45 or over that and this is going to affect the ladies over the age of 40 if you're over the age of 40 you are going to be connecting there is someone um, some of you could have met that person in the past realize that um, you know the person is married or whatever the situation is and you think um, no let me not go there you know because I know some of you Capricorns will think you know I don't want to have something with a married man and that sort of a thing and then in the weekend this person is going to come back and there are going to be because I'm seeing text messages coming from this person to you text messages I'm seeing calls text messages it's as if this person wants a new start because here it is the ace of one um, the fool going on a new journey in a relationship so obviously um, whatever that you have left behind whatever that you have said you know this is not for me this person is coming back and this person is coming back because they know that you both have a connection but something has transpired and whatever that has transpired has to do with the energy of someone both at the age of 40 that is an Aries Leo and Sagittarius now this person had in vain in the relationship for whatever reason um, whatever reason this person um, got in the relationship but um, they make you know just oh my god they they, they were just so lying um, and um, and you decided to you know not to go further with that relationship and this person is going to be coming back into your life some of you but some of you are going to be meeting someone and you know um for some of you that is going to start something new or um connect with you know new situations and that sort of a thing a new start is coming in for you this new start you're going to meet someone and for the single people or whoever you are that is about to start something new you're going to be meeting the love of your life you are going to be meeting the love of your life and this person is going to make you very rich it is a karmatic situation this person is really going to make you rich now in the future there is someone that some of you are going to meet especially the ladies over 40 I'm seeing this and the men um, between the ages of 25 and 45 you are going to be meeting this person too um, this person can is going to be a cancer no, Pisces cancer or a scorpion and this is in the future it's as if they are close by it can be a man it, it can be three weeks to a month but they're very close by and you know positive news is going to be um, coming in very much positive news is going to be coming in okay this is positive happy news good news is going to be coming in um, some surprises is going to be coming in for a lot of you guys oh god I'm always over the time with you Pisces why is that happy news is going to be coming in someone new is going to be coming in your life so be aware of this be open um, don't close off yourself because I know you Capricorns could be in the mood of not want to meet and invitations or going to you're going to be receiving an invitation and it's going to be an happy invitation um, 
the angels of abundance are here and they are um, letting you know that successful funding so if you were waiting on financial help or money to buy a house or to start a business or your business is going to take off in this week so this is wonderful I have to say goodbye my darlings um, namaste we've gone over the time I speak to you guys next week